Well, Pagenk standing over this free kick for Derry City. It's looking so dry tonight here in the brand new Pagenk whips it under. Oh my God. A hospital ball to Cameron McJanet. McJanet does well. Clears long downfield. Mark Conley's onto this. And then goes down. Sean Kavna finds Andy Lyons. Lyons under foot with Kavna. Kavna gets a shot away, and it's a good save from Brian Maher in the end up. Half chance to be fair. Yeah. On his good foot it's as the, well. I think it's the first real save that yeah. Brian Maher has made, Sean. So uh, with Derry just two minutes gone, it's not mm, too bad. Derry just having. Started this second half yet, they just haven't been able to put their foot in the ball and just seemed to be a, an injection of pace yeah, all of a sudden. This is where they need to be, they need to be in Rovers half. You know. Conley forward to Jack and Tunde. Bodies forward. Oh, patching, patching oh, Michael, oh, oh, Michael Duffy nearly got his first goal of the season, but it's a fantastic save in the end up from Alan Manis. Ah, he's done everything right. This is a really good save from Alan. Oh. He could have really made an immediate impact as Mark Conley lost the ball forward. Well, patching done really well following Sean Hoare's mistake. Just to roll it in the path of the onrush and Michael Duffy. Joined Rovers in 2018. Not a couple of titles he's in his locker. Jack Byrne just shows too much of that to Patrick McElhinney. McElhinney steps away from one challenge, gets under it. Age of the 18, slaps it under the path of Ryan Graydon. Graydon with the pass! Oh, he just oh, couldn't get it on the end of it. And then Sean Hoare and Lee Grace both combine as Alan Manis goes down. But what a golden opportunity for Derry City. I thought Ryan Graydon had just smuggled it under. Alan Manis McElhinney did see. really well he's, re he's really proactive with it. it was a oh. first time shot he had got the better of him but I think it just came at McElhinney far too quickly mm. I hope you're enjoying the live stream it's certainly been one of those games with plenty of action albeit that there hasn't been a goal scored yet but uh, Derry City trying to make amends through that as Dan Cleary right. clears only as far as Patrick McElhinney McElhinney rolls it under the path of Domigan Domigan trying to play at the back post Ooh. And it's an outstretched leg from Dan Cleary. Sees the ball go out for an hour. Derry City corner. As we approach the last three and a half minutes here at the Brandywell, live on LOA TV. Patching again into the six yard box. Manus comes out. And again, it's Cameron McJanet. They just seem they can't pick McJanet up whenever he gets under that six yard box. Just arriving late. It's three or four really good glancing headers. Yeah. Just can't seem to direct it on. Kieran Call as well. But you can't, it's so crowded on there. But McJanet, he just seems to get a touch on yeah. it every time. The Alan Manus goal kick. Manus does eventually clear, and on the 95th minute, Paul McLaughlin brings proceedings to a close here at the Ryan McBride Brandywell Stadium, where it's finished. Gary City nil. Shamrock Rovers, no. 